Hi everybody, it's Mary Ellen Stites from Create With Me and I'm here in the Creativity Nest for Teach Me Tuesday. So you've created the most beautiful card. That This is this gorgeous card and it's ready to um, put in the mail to brighten someone's day. So let's talk today about um, shushing up our envelope, okay? So I'm gonna take you down to my desk. Here's our beautiful card and I need to put this in an envelope, but I just don't wanna leave my envelope plain I want to zhuzh it up a little bit and that and that's what we're going to talk about today on how to use our new embossing folders um these are new because they're new out of the new catalog to make our um envelopes really really pretty so um what we're going to do is just take a regular white envelope and we need to have our boss our um, stamp and cut and emboss machine um you cannot use the mini for this you will need the regular size one to do this to your envelopes so we've got a plethora of um, folders here. So I'm just gonna start with this one. This is a um, floral folder. Oh gosh, I should know the name for you. I'll post it in the um, comments. So here's the folder and here is our envelope. And what I'm gonna do is I'm, I always wanna make sure that the Stampin' Up <clears throat> logo is on top because this is the emboss side, unless I wanna deboss and I'll show you that too. <clears throat> but I usually want the embossing to be up and I'm all I'm doing is putting the flap of the envelope in here and folding the rest of the um, envelope underneath our folder. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's talk a little bit about um, your sandwich. So when you're doing a folder, you're going to take your cutting plate out. You're going to put down your plate number three onto your um, base put your folder down, this is a standard folder, and then cover it up and run it through your um, big shot, your, not your big shot, your big boss. See how things get ingrained in us? And then your, your envelope is gonna come out. It's got a little bit of static on it. Let's pull that out. And look how beautiful that envelope is. It's so gorgeous. So this flowers on here. We could even um, use our blending brush and add a little color if we wanted to some of that. So let me show you um, another idea. And this one's using a different folder that is one of our 3D folders. So when you're using a 3D folder, um, so this is kind of like two Teach Me Tuesdays, you're going to remove your cutting plate. You're gonna, let's get the envelope. I've got one here okay i'm gonna bring in this very vanilla one and i'm going to slip my i just slipping my uh, envelope flap in you can try both sides see which one you like the best i like this flower here and then i'm going to put this on my platform and then i'm going to cover it with my um, plate number four which is my embossing uh, my for my 3d folders and then i'm going to run it through so I don't need any cutting plates. I just need this 3D uh, number four. I haven't seen this yet, so let's see what happens. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Can you see that? It is so gorgeous. I'm gonna lift my light up here so I can see. There you go. Now you can see the light. That is amazing. Oh, I can't get enough of that. That is so beautiful. So let me show you. Um, some of the other ones I didn't advance. So let's say that you just want to tell someone hello. They want it, you want to, um, them to see that this is going to be a hello card. I use the um, hello folder. They're, they're just mini ones, but you still can't use your mini because the envelope is um, this wide. So that won't run through. Gorgeous. Then here's the other folder that comes in there. So you're sending a thank you card. That's thank you, grazie, danke. Uh, I, can't, I can't even read. Mahalo. That's where we're going here in another. Well, that's where I'll be when you see this video in Hawaii. There's that one. Here's that flower again. I want to show it in the light. And then here's one that I deboss. I deboss this with the polka dots. And here's the embossed side. So you can see what it would look like on both sides. So if you're thinking that this is only for women cards, how about these for the masculine cards? So Here's that checker uh, weave, and then there's a dot. Both of those would be appropriate for um, 
to send to a gentleman. So um, that's Teach Me Tuesday, uh, how to zhuzh up your envelope, and then just a little bit about using the different kinds of folders. We have regular ones and 3D folders. If you need something out of the new catalog, you can go visit createwithme.stampinup.net. There's my host code, snag a picture of it. And as usual, um, like, comment, and share. I appreciate you. And I'll see you next week for Teach Me Tuesday at 2 p.m. Central Time. Bye, everybody. Have a great day.